did you guys pay any attention to Photoshop generative fill? Give me your, give me your thoughts. On the one hand, I'm like the, the box is already open, right? It's smart, right? It makes sense that you would just be able to use that. If you wanted something in the sky, right? You could say, give me, give me rich puffy clouds. It goes beyond just cutting out somebody you don't like in a family photo. Are we reaching a point one day where we don't actually have to go out with our cameras? Is that the idea that we can just build? Are you excited? Jordan is shaking his head at you. Like it's insanely useful. I mean, the thing that drives me crazy is so many people like showing a clip from Good, Bad, and the Ugly, which has the best close-ups maybe of any movie ever. And they're like, look, we can now extend it so you can see the whole desert. And it's like, you don't understand anything about composition. Like this is not an improvement. Uh, so it's going to be misused. I like this because it's something that's actually practically useful, but it's not as easy to actually like create a false narrative with it as it is with a lot of the other AI stuff that I find no. truly horrifying right now.